a time for like today where there is an abundance of renewable energy, solar reserves and wind, which drives down uh, wholesale power prices and retail power prices, which allows organisations like Planet Arc to install 14 electric chargers here at this shopping centre, incentivise people when they come to shop to charge their vehicles. We've announced a world first project that's focused on using electric vehicle charging with a battery interposed uh, to the grid to enable really rapid charging of electric vehicles. Essentially $800,000 out of the $3 million capital cost for this project is government grant funding. It shows they're, they're backing the business model but also it closes that commercial gap. The boost is, is one of the key features of integrating with the, uh, with the store. It incentivises a customer firstly to come and use the EV charging bay. They can connect their car, starts charging at a slower rate. Once they come into the store, they swipe the boost kiosk and that'll automatically kick into a really fast charge. And in this case, we were able to charge a normal sort of electric vehicle with a range of three or 400 kilometres in about 15 minutes. We have Australian made technology that is integrated uh, within uh, the battery unit itself. And that actually allows the, the charge and discharge from the grid that wouldn't ordinarily be available without this electric technology. So it really enables a large scale battery, fast charging, and then also, we're able to do this before there's been an uptake in EV. We're increasing foot traffic, we're increasing the attractiveness of coming to this particular precinct, and we're, we're doing all that without costing the owners of the precinct anything. We are moving around in vehicles. Uh, EV vehicles is, is here, here and now and, and will grow. Uh, having the ability to charge on site really keeps a part of our broader sustainability plan. We're looking to build a portfolio over the next two years of about $30 million worth of uh, similar type projects. We have already a significant interest to roll this out once this particular project's operational. And so the future eventually becomes where Planet Arc Power becomes a distributed uh, utility of the future.